All right, Roger, thank you. The Little League team from Grain New Gloucester and Raymond just losing their first game at the Little League World Series in Williamsport. Our Connor Clement is there where that game just wrapped up a few minutes ago. Connor, a big accomplishment to get to that point, but not really the outcome that everyone was hoping for. Yeah, John, I mean, that's perfectly said by you. Let's remember the accomplishment of getting here to Williamsport for this great new Gloucester Little League team, the way that they came and beat Massachusetts to get here twice, one of the better teams in New England, and then they come here. It's not the performance they're looking for. Uh, they got off to a slow start. They had ace pitcher Caden uh, Oliver on the mound for them. He, he struggled, and, and it's not something we saw from this team really in their postseason run. They went 12-0 and leading into this game. They outscored opponents 82-9, to and the Seattle team just came out and hit the ball where this main team wasn't. They hit it into gaps. You know, they uh, played good on defense. Maine struggled on the defensive side of the field. They had four errors in this game, and they ultimately lose this thing 10 to nothing. Now, the good news is it's a double, double elimination tournament, so Maine has another chance to, to right their wrongs here and get back in the winner's column. They're going to be back playing on Saturday afternoon at some point here, uh, I believe at Lambity Stadium, where they just played Seattle, the Northwest region team. So it's not all over for this team from Great New Gloucester, Raymond, but uh, a tough one to start things here in Williamsport day one for their first game of the Little League World Series. We'll continue to track their uh, appearance here in Williamsport. We'll have more coming up at 530 and 6 for now reporting in Williamsport live. Connor Clement, Maine's total coverage. All right, we are cheering them on, Connor. Thank you. The towns of Gray and New Gloucester, they're also cheering them on, continuing to celebrate and support their team. Our Miles Hood joins us live from New Gloucester, a watch party there. And Miles, I'm sure a lot of disappointed fans there this afternoon. Yeah, a lot of long faces, a lot of ahs and oohs, but it was a good game and it was a proud time here. Everyone here that I spoke to really said they were proud of the boys and their accomplishments, just like Connor was saying. They conquered the region, they conquered the state, and that's really what they're proud of right now. This event is actually sponsored by Cumberland County Federal Credit Union, and they're actually having a, a raffle just after the game. So they're really trying to keep the spirits as high as they can here. Uh, and like Connor was saying, this is a double elimination thing. So while the team is not down, they are not out. And so this community will continue to support their boys as they chase history. I'm going to send it right back to you guys reporting in New Gloucester. I'm Miles Hood for Maine's Total Coverage.